Hello everyone, this is Crime Alley Comics. First of all, I want to start off by saying Happy Father's Day to all you fathers out there. And uh, hope you're having a great day, hope you got some great gifts, and got to spend time with your families. Um, got a couple of things up here to show you that I got for Father's Day. So I want to start out with um, Father's Day gifts today. I've already showed you a few of them, but I'll show you everything I've got up to this point. <laughs> so as you can see on the left, I have a Batgirl figure that I got from my oldest son, Anthony. That was pretty cool. Then on the right, um, right over here, my oldest daughter, Megan, she got me that uh, Batman Who Laughs figure, which... Uh, is part of the same DC Multiverse group as the Batgirl figure. There's one other figure, I think it's uh, Nightwing, if I remember right. Let me come over here. Let's see. Yeah, Nightwing. So there's that one figure to get. And over here, you'll see this Batmobile. Well, each one of these figures has a Batmobile piece in it. Can't see it real well, but anyway, that's uh, get that to where there's no glare. Both of these figures have the Batman or the Batmobile piece in it, a different one. And then the Nightwing has the third one, so I want to try to pick that up. And then also. I think I already showed you this, but I'll show you again. This is what my oldest daughter got me also, Megan. Um, Alfred with Wayne Manor. Pretty cool Funko Pop there. And uh, then my youngest daughter, she got me this really cool um, wall hanging like a Batman scene that it goes through it's pretty cool now I gotta find a place to hang it <laughs> so that's that and then I don't remember if I showed this or not but this is what my wife got me for Father's Day this uh, Space Force coin. Very cool. It's a, a Kennedy half dollar that's had this, uh, this printing put on it for the, uh, for the new Space Force. Pretty cool. So yeah. Those are some things I got for Father's Day. Oh, and down here at the bottom, this uh, says, love you, Dad. That came from my youngest daughter as well, Heather. So those are the things I got for Father's Day. So if my kids are watching, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Love all you guys. Um, so now I want to go through um, some books that I've picked up in the last week um well actually it was last weekend i went to frankie d's and i picked up <laughs> i picked up about 47 books i think something like that from frankie d's and then i also went to jake's and picked up a few books and i got some books from midtown comics now there's still a few comics that i haven't got in yet that i ordered way back in march and they just haven't come out or they haven't you know haven't sent them yet uh and i know Two of those books are going to be here pretty soon. Uh, the other one, I'm not sure when it's coming because they haven't notified me yet of when it's getting shipped. <laughs> so <laughs> I guess we'll just wait and see what happens with that one. So I want to show you a few books. Uh, these are books that I got from Frankie D's. Uh, I'll try to make this quick just because I don't want this video to get too awfully long. Move that chair out of the way. Uh, I picked up another Mr. T and the T-Force 
with the uh, card. I still didn't get the foil cover. I'd like to find a foil cover as well. So there's that. Uh, sit these over here. And I just love this old cheesy movie, Plan 9 from Outer Space. And I found this comic book for it, which is really cool. This is by Blue Water Comics. And this is issue number one. Pick up another Leonard Nimoy's Primortals. This is issue number one. I thought this one was cool. President Pence, number one. <laughs> thought that was a cool comic. Oh, and then I found something that I've been wanting to get for a while. It's not the whole run, but it's quite a few of them. Galaxy Quest. This is by IDW. That's number one. They didn't have number two, but I got number three. Number four. And number five. So I was real happy to pick those up. I love the Galaxy Quest movie. And then I got The Amazing Spider-Man, number 23. And that is, I believe, an Alex Ross cover. Moon Knight Annual, number one. Picked up another official index of the Marvel Universe. And yet another official index of the Marvel Universe. Then I thought this was pretty cool. John Romita Jr. 30th Anniversary Special. Whoops, sorry about the glare. Eh, there we go. So some interesting books I picked up there. Get a few more of them up here. Some of these I haven't rebagged and boarded or anything. They still got the price tag on them. But like I said, these these books uh, were all dollar books, but they had a 50% off sale, so these were all 50 cents. John Burns Next Men number number one did not have that copy. Star Trek and the Legions or Le Legion of Superheroes number six. Very cool cover. Star Trek Missions End, also by IDW. And of course, you all know I'm a big original series fan, so. Star Trek Mirror Images, issue number five. Star Trek Klingons, and this is from the fourth or the fifth movie, uh, or no, I'm sorry, sixth movie. Um, oh gosh, ain't that awful? I can't think of the name of it. Um, oh, I can't remember. Anyway, there you go. Photo cover. 
You get a little bit of the light off of this thing. Got too much glare. See if that'll help. Star Trek City on the Edge of Forever. Star Trek Wrath of Khan. Spock cover. Star Trek Year 4. Star Trek 50th Anniversary. I already had this one, but I got another one for 50 cents, so not going to complain. <laughs> Joker's Asylum 2, The Riddler, Num and this is a one-shot, I believe. Yeah. Like I said, I haven't re and boarded these, so the bags are kind of kind of wrinkly and stuff on them. Joker's Asylum, Scarecrow, number one. Very cool cover. Joker's Wild. And this is by Tenant Comics. Well, there's just a lot of glare on this. Oh, I also picked up uh, some more of the Art Germ Dance covers. Final Crisis Aftermath. I now have two complete sets of these books. Final Crisis Aftermath. Uh, that was number two, I believe. The first one I showed you, yeah. The first one was two and this one's three. Hang on just a second, I gotta pick up some more books here. Again, dance. This is number four. I already had a couple of copies of number one. So with these it makes two full full runs. This is number five. Yeah, number five. All right. Oh, and I think I already had number six, so that, yeah, so that completed that run the second time. This one is Battle for the Cowl, Oracle, number one, one shot. New Talent Showcase. Number one. Arrow season 2.5, number five. Arrow season 2.5, number three. Then Arrow, number one. I think I already had this one, but 50 cents. Not going to complain. Uh, let me re-maneuver some things here. Keep those from falling off. That Girl, Birds of Prey, number 12. And I picked up another Return of Bruce Wayne, number one of six. Roz Al Ghul, 
This is also uh, Bruce Wayne, the return home, or the road home, rather. Uh, this is a uh, Ra's al Ghul one-shot. Very cool cover. Birds of Prey number 16. And Dove number six. Beware the Batman number one from the cartoon. I'm sorry, from the animated series. Batman and Robin number zero. Alright, now, that's my haul from Frankie D's. Get these out of the way. Now, my haul from Jake's, it's not near as many. <laughs> and I got a couple of these because I thought my wife would want them. Uh, but it wasn't Annie that Annie's not the movie I was thinking that's the movie I was thinking of but that wasn't the one that that she liked it was uh, Matilda so anyway I picked up this Annie number one from Marvel Comics and Annie number two Then I got this Detective Comics number 464. DC Comics Presents Superman and Demon. Or the Demon? Or the Demon. Not Demoned. DC Comics presents Superman and or versus the Omega Men. This is number 89. The first one was number 66. This one's number 89. Okay, where you can see the whole book. I'm trying to keep the glare off of this, but don't have my light position quite as well as I should. And another Charlton Comics. Scary Tales. Whoops, sorry. Very interesting looking cover. <laughs> All right, so that's my haul from um, Jake's. Now, let me get this situated here. So I got these all flipped around backwards. So, these are from, and I don't remember exactly which ones came from where, but these are from my LCS. Let's see if I can turn that this way a little bit. From my LCS and from Midtown Comics. This one I know I got from the LCS. Detective Comics number 475 uh, facsimile cover. I have the original cover too, but I love that cover, so I wanted to get another or get that one. Now, Batman number 92, Art Germ cover, first cover of Punchline, or first book with Punchline on the cover. So I got that one, and I got, I bought that one from my LCS. This one here. And number three came from Midtown Comics. So I have three copies of that, but I got an extra copy because a friend of mine was wanting a copy of that, and I don't know if he was able to get it, so I, I picked up a third copy. And uh, if he did, wasn't able to get it, then I'll 
let him have that one. So, okay, Shazam, number twelve. Shazam, number twelve. And Catwoman's 80th anniversary art germ cover. I got the art germ cover. And I got the 1960s Catwoman cover. Very, very awesome. Okay. So that's my haul. Let me get back over to my computer here. I have so much stuff scattered around in here it's not even funny. <laughs> I really got to clean this place up. So anyway, okay, so that's my haul. Now, my contest is up next weekend. So if you haven't put in, uh, if you haven't done my contest yet and you still want to, you've got about a week, not quite a week because it's actually ending the 26th. Well, let me take that back. I had said the 26th, but um, Metarog had the 27th on uh, on the comic book uh, or the um, <laughs> contest roundup so since he has that down for the 27th I'm gonna let it go to the 27th so no no problem no pro I think the 27th is uh, next Saturday so and I'll probably do the drawing oh I'll I may do it Sunday it just depends on what I got going on it may be Monday before I do the drawing and if I have time I'm going to try to to uh, do it live if I can get that to work I haven't messed with that for a while and I've been, really been wanting to get my live videos going so that I could do some videos with some other people and uh, I've just I've struggled with it a little bit my internet is not the fastest around here I live in a small town it's you know like 1800 people or less and the internet we have here is not um, well it's just not very fast <laughs> so I have trouble with uh, streaming sometimes because it, it wants to cut out and so on and I try doing this from upstairs and my router for my Wi-Fi is downstairs so I may have to go downstairs to do that and uh, but anyway I'm going to do some experimenting with it and hopefully I can do this as a live video rather than just tape it and then put it you know put it up but uh, so anyway that's coming up next week I have 24 entries so far and I'm sorry I don't have the sheet up here with me there have been a few additions um, to this contest uh, as far as you know people that have um, entered the contest um, I had a couple yesterday well one of them was Joker 68 <laughs> and he even mentioned that you know you don't have to enter me in the contest I'm just doing this for support but you know what Joker 68 is the reason I started doing videos so I can't count him out especially when he put in um, you know he done the comments and and told me the three things uh, he would like to see or would like to do once this coronavirus um, shutdown or well whatever you want to call it at this stage uh, restrictions have been lifted so you know he met all the criteria of course I'm gonna put him in the contest <laughs> so Joker you're in it buddy <laughs> and there was a couple others and I'm sorry I can't think of their names right now but um, either when I I'll either do another video or when I do the comic book artist spotlight video I will read them off then possibly but anyway I will read the list off before next weekend before we do the drawing and I think that's all I have for tonight I hope you enjoyed this um, got some really cool books you know I like picking up stuff that's kind of obscure um, you know like that uh, John Romita Jr. book and stuff like that uh, I like having stuff that's a little different so so that was cool 
and uh, I, I have you know I, I'm really thrilled that I have places around here like Jake's and and Frankie D's and places like that that uh, that actually have some really good quality comic books that are cheap <laughs> and occasionally I get some really good deals on some uh, books that are worth much more than what I pay for them so I'm really happy about that with that I just want to say once again happy Father's Day to all of you fathers out there in YouTube land uh, I hope you have a great day God bless and we will see you all next video